Hello friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. In this tutorial, let us learn how to show only predecessors in Gantt chart in Primavera P6. Generally, to view or show predecessors of any activity in Primavera P6, we go to the Relation tab under Activity Details. If you want to trace the driving activity from the Relations tab of any activity, we click the Go to button here. But this would be difficult to identify which are those activities. So I recommend to show them in the Gantt chart itself, which will be easy to understand. First, let us set some settings in the bars of Gantt chart to look them clean. Right click on the Gantt chart and select bars. Select the bar which is showed in the Gantt chart. And at this bottom, you can see by default, the show bar when collapsed option is checked. You need to uncheck them in order to not to show when they are collapsed. Repeat this process for all the bars. And for the summary bar, set the bar label as activity name. Rather than finish, I would like to show the activity name. And now let us start the actual process step by step. Step 1. Go to view and click on collapse all. Okay. Now go to the project completion activity that is the final activity name and select a driving predecessor from the relation tab and click on this go to button. You will jump to the predecessor immediately. Repeat this process and observe that the WBS of each predecessor is expanding whenever you are clicking on this go to options. Now you will have a report showing all driving predecessor in GAN chat for a selected activity like this. It looks nice, right? So friends, this is all about how to show only predecessors in GAN chat in Primavera P6. If you have enjoyed this tutorial, please give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe DP Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.